What's on YouTube? This your boy Lee, Lee TV, and today we gonna do something different. We got the men up. Yeah, ladies, this episode is strictly for y'all. Yeah, I see you all in my comment section. So I'm showing you some love, and I got men up here for y'all today. Tell me right now, out of the lineup that you see, which one would you choose? Which one would you allow to take you out and spend some time with you? Let me tell you this, they shoes look way better than, hey, whatever. Continue. Hey, before we do that, stop what you're doing. Go hit that like, comment, and share button, man. Make sure you subscribe too now. I see y'all started watching, but y'all ain't subscribed to my channel. What's going on? Y'all don't want me to make it? You don't want me to make it? I'm going to make it anyway. God got me. Don't never confuse it. Let me. Yeah, that's just a little jokey joke. But yeah, I'm going to make it anyway. Consistency, dedication is key. Another thing. If you want any help on real estate, crypto, anything, flipping houses, get at me. Let me know. Put it in the comment section. Yeah, I mentor you. Get you right all the way. Retarded. Yeah, yeah. That was a little acting, but you know. Let's get to the video. Subscribe. Hello, welcome in. What's your name? Brittany. Brittany, how old are you? Uh, 30. And what do you do? Um, I'm a chief of operations at a marketing company. Okay. Yes, girl. <laughs> I'm so nervous. I'm so sorry, y'all. I'm shaking this. and everything. <laughs> now, what are some things like to do for fun? Um, so I hope like part-time um, when I'm not working, obviously. Mm -hmm. um, travel. I like to just be outdoors. Okay. Um, I'm an outdoorsy type of girl. <sighs> nice. But um, yeah, I'm so nervous. <laughs> you got this. <laughs> now, what are you tell us her ethnicity? What is she? Put in the comment section right now if y'all know her ethnicity. I'm going to tell you now. She definitely my type. But I got to see where her mind at. Looks can be deceiving. You can't judge a book until you open it and read it. Continue. What are some things you look for in a man? Um, an alpha man. Like someone who can take lead. Um, someone, like I said, adventurous. Mm -hmm. um, funny. I love like to laugh. Mm -hmm. um, someone like very sportsy. You don't have to play necessarily any sport, but you have to like know about mm. like the game, like preferably like football or basketball. But okay. yeah. <laughs> yeah. And now, what are some of your deal breakers? Um, communication. Like if you don't know how to, you know, be receptive and actually communicate like your feelings. Mm -hmm. Like if you, for example, if you're feeling um, mad about something or upset, like I would want you to tell me what it is yeah. instead of like keeping it in. Um, someone who's not confident. Mm. I need like a confident person. I don't want to keep like kind of like I don't mind, you know, giving you your, your light and like, you know, helping you build that confidence, but yeah. you kinda have to have, it have that. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. Okay. Uh, All right. So we did get a couple of pop balloons. Let's go on over there, see why they ended up popping. Okay, let's start with your name and age. My name is Anthony and I'm 29. All right. And Anthony, why'd you end up popping your balloon? Um, I'm gonna just have to say off of initial attraction. Okay. Yeah. All right. <laughs> and now is Anthony someone that you're talking No. Okay. And why not? Uh, just the way he looks. Okay. Yeah. And then we did get another pop down here. Let me know. Tell me what y'all think about that. How y'all feel about Anthony? Let me know in the comment section right now. Do you think she misjudged him? Uh, do y'all even think that she gave him a chance? Do y'all think that she gave him a chance? It's that fruit. Continue. Sir, your name and age? My name is Seiku and I'm 30. And Seiku, why'd you end up popping your balloon? She not necessarily my type. She beautiful. She give me auntie vibes, though. That's why I pop. But she's a beautiful woman, though. Okay. Okay. Got it. Now, is uh, Seiku someone that's your type? Kind of. Kind okay. of. <laughs> but why give auntie vibes? Um, you just, I, it's your tone and your voice. It, it's, it's like stern. Like, you give me auntie vibes. Where are you from? I'm from Jersey. And I give auntie vibes. Okay. All right. <laughs> All right. My fault. My fault. I'm, I'm just saying. No, you good. You good. Okay. <laughs> Let's go on over here. Your name and age? Um, 
see a little man, huh? She mad about being called auntie, ain't she? I don't remember what her age. Y'all put in the comment section right now what's her age. Did she tell us her age? I don't remember. I was lost in the beauty, not the booty. <laughs> Continue. I'm Lou, 33. Okay, and Lou, why'd you end up popping your balloon? I think she's attractive. I like some of her hobbies, but it's just not my type. Okay. Yeah. Got it. Got it. Now, is he someone that's your yeah. type? All right. And why not? That's bald head. Yeah. <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> you lost all the baldies? <laughs> all right. Thank you, Lou. <laughs> Let's head on back. <laughs> sorry, y'all. Sorry, y'all. <laughs> I'm sorry. All right. Your, your name and age? I got, hey, my name is Robert. I'm 29. I got PTSD from being bald, man. <laughs> Oh, damn. <laughs> no, no, but uh, other, outside of that remark, I love everything about you. Oh, thank you. Yeah, thank and you. you have a very strong presence. Thank and, you. you know, yeah. I can, not auntie, right? Not auntie. Oh, no, I, I don't know what he was talking about. <laughs> <laughs> no, no. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so you no. pop because the bald statement, obviously. Yeah, you know, hey, sometimes you just can't control it. So. <laughs> okay, so obviously I know you just said you're not a fan of bald. So is he someone that's your type? Actually, you're actually, like, really cute. Like, I really find you attractive. I appreciate like, oh, it. Kind of kept the wound. Even you though know. I did say the bald head, like, I mean, at the end of the day, you know, like, it's not like a big deal breaker. You have some balls, and I'm not actually, like I said, you're attractive. So. I appreciate it. Yeah. I appreciate yeah. it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Robert. She called dude cute. That is not a compliment, dude. Come on now. Can't call a grown man cute now. She said, You get a pass on the ball. I get a pass on the ball. She's feeling it on you. Give me my balloon back, man. <laughs> Let's get that balloon back. <laughs> Got it. Okay, we'll be back for you then. Okay. Let's head on back this way. Name and age? Kendall, 28. Okay, Kendall, why did we end up popping our balloon? It's the same, the ball, you know. You're not bald. Going, it's going, you know, it's lining up a little bit. <laughs> yeah. Um, but other than that, she had great energy. Uh, I love hooping too, so, and I'm very competitive as well. Yeah, I'm uh, with sports, so. Yeah. Okay, got oh. it. Now, is Kendall someone that you're tight? Yeah, no, he's attractive. I don't see the bald, though. I'm confused on him. <laughs> Let's see. Tilt down. Maybe slow, we're missing slow, it. Slow. Nah, you, you, you good. You good. I don't know. I just okay. four years. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, that boy definitely going bald. Bald? Where you at? Come get him. Look at her face, y'all. Look at her face. Oh, they thought that was funny. Continue. <laughs> All right, Kendall. <laughs> and I think we just got to pop down there. Let's head on over there. All right, let's get your name and age. My name is Agnell. I'm 29. Okay. And Agnell, why'd you end up popping your balloon? I was looking at how she responded to how the other dudes were, you know, critiquing. And I just didn't like it. She seems like she's mean. She's kind of concealing it a little bit. But, mm. yeah, so okay. I just didn't like how she reacted a little bit so okay so you said you're getting like that she's like undercover me yeah no nah, like <laughs> it, it just seems like she would be very argumentative okay. what do you think about that i disagree but okay. i don't want to say too much because i might be argumentative so <laughs> that scene Bingo. it's okay it's all right. Right. <laughs> thank you Bingo. okay let's head on Walk back over. so we have Four balloons left unpopped. Let's go ahead and ask these remaining guys a question, whatever question you may have. For um, she definitely is somebody that I would, if I seen her in public, I definitely would run down on her for sure. Like, no count. Continue. Mm hmm. I don't want to be like the typical, you know, like main general question. So, um, if you had to describe, well, if you had to choose a superhero that described your characteristics or who you guys are, uh, what would it be? Who would it be and why? Mm. Look at them, they're all thinking. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's start here. Man, she lost me. If I could be a superhero, who would I be? Baby girl, I'm a grown man. I am my own superhero. Continue. Here. Uh, Frozone. Frozone. Yeah. My Why? super suit, man. <laughs> Where's my super suit? Well, you know, he's a family guy. 
You know, he's willing to go and risk his life for the, for the city, for the people. Mm-hmm. He's black, you know what I mean? So, yeah, yeah I mean, it's not a lot of black superheroes. It's true. And if you say uh, Black Panther, that's a cliche. So, mm-hmm. can't I like count. that. Uh, okay. So, yes. The Frozone. Frozone. Got it. Okay. okay. You're here, your name and age, and so what superhero would you be? My name is Brian, and I'm 33. Um, I'd probably go with the Flash. I'm really addicted to saving time. I get a lot done in a short amount of time, and it's it's kind of my thing. Okay, okay. <laughs> Let's go over here. Your name and age, and what superhero? Jason. I'm 28, and I would say Mbaku, leader of the Jebari. That's yeah, I was. That's yeah. different. Why? Um, his personality is very similar to mine. Um, mm-hmm. If you've seen Black Panther, mm-hmm. he's very, very caring of his community. Mm-hmm. Very, like, kind of alpha type. Yeah. Very, like, brawler kind of type. Yeah. Um, I feel like I resemble that okay. a lot. Yeah. That's what I would choose. That's cool. Mm-hmm. That's a dope answer. Yeah. That's cool. different. All right. Let's go over here. Name and age and answer your question. My name is Cliff, and I'm 31 years old. Um, superhero, I'll be, uh, say, Static Shock. And oh, I say cool. Static Shock because, yeah. you know, Dreads, me, Locks. Got it. Fun. Got it. You know, back in the day, that was, like, one of the shows growing, growing up. up. Yeah, yeah, growing yeah. up, watching <laughs> So Static Shock, that was me. I feel like that was me, that character. That was fun, energetic, you know, just good for the kids. You know, someone African-American, too, as well, you know, with Locke. So that was something that we can watch growing up. So I feel like Static Shock was me. It's dope. Okay. I like that answer. Okay, YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, whichever platform you watching me on, put it in the comment section right now. What superhero would you be? Me and put it in the comment section right now. If y'all could remember her question, put it in the comment section right now. Let's get it popping. Continue. All right, let's head on back. And it is time to pop a balloon. Out of these four guys, I'm going to have you pop one balloon. Okay. Mm -hmm. And so let me go ahead and hand you a pick. There you go. Thank you. Just go ahead and pop that one. Right now, right? Yeah, okay. whenever you're ready. <laughs> Sorry. Okay, so why did we end up popping his? Um, I like everything that you said. Like, your answers were very, very dope. Um, it's the fit. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. What's, what's up with the fit? Um, the pants. I don't, um, I'm not, I don't like them. The, the shirt with the cut. Where are you from again? Orlando. Orlando? Yeah. Okay. Um, yeah. I just, yeah. Like I said, the shirt, the pants. Jordan's are kind of tight up, really, really tight. Like you put the run somewhere, but yeah, overall. Yeah, you just. Let me know what y'all think about this outfit. Y'all feeling it? I don't know. I have no opinion on home outfit. I have no opinion on his look. That's a man. I don't judge other men, but. Or speak on other men, but let me know in the comment section. Take a flash on me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's okay. So, Brian, why'd you have your balloon unpopped for her? Um, I wanted to hear more about her. She's beautiful uh, as well. Um, she's got a good career also. So, thank you. Yeah, definitely. thank you. Thank you. Okay, go ahead and ask these guys another question. Um. Hmm. If you were on a vacation, what are three main things that you would like to do? Or like have to do? Okay, let's start down. That's a good question. If I'm on a vacation, three main things I would have to do, Lee TV, Lee, what Lee got to do on a vacation? First thing first, I got to go hit up every traditional spot or I got to go straight to the project, straight to the, straight where it's, yeah. Straight to the slums. I'm ready to be embraced by everybody that love me. The people just like me. I, yeah, I ain't trying to go over there with all them people that got all the money with they, yeah, in the, yeah, you know, them stuck up people. I ain't gonna, I'm not gonna fit in. Take me over there to the slums with the people that, yeah, you know, you know what's going on. If you know, you know. If you don't, I ain't finna tell you. Continue. Down there and come back up. All right, let's start here. 
Uh, <clears throat> my name is Cliff, 31. Mm-hmm. <laughs> um, so vacation, uh, I like to plan stuff. So the first thing I go, uh, I like.